Brand Monitoring. In this chapter, you'll learn how to set up projects to monitor your brand and how to differentiate the brand Apple from Apple's. And also tips and tricks on finding relevant mentions and insights. In order to navigate through all the content online, posts, comments, and articles, we need to create projects with the right keywords that will narrow down our search. Let's go into the Projects tab. Now you'll see a list of all your projects that you've created so far. If you want to start a new project, click the Create button. The system will then offer you three setup options. You can choose from Brand, Social Profiles, and Advanced Search Options. First, let's take a look at brand analysis in detail. This is the most frequently used type of project. If you want to have a quick idea how a specific term is performing online, for example, Apple, Samsung, Home Office, or online banking, then select Brand Monitoring. First of all, you need a topic you want to research and analyze. Let's say I want to know what customers think about Apple products in English speaking markets. As you can see, we can search the system in more than 70 languages. Enter the word iPhone in the keyword field and press enter. The system ignores special characters. However, it is worth thinking about misspelled versions of this keyword or slang words. In this case, let's add Apple phone as well. If you add Apple phone in quotation marks, the system will only look for phrases where the word Apple and the word phone appear next to each other. However, if you type the phrase Apple phone without quotation marks, then the system will be looking for phrases where both words appear, but not necessarily close to each other. This means you may get results about any random phone or Apple's fruits. As you type each new word, the system will indicate here how many new mentions were added to your results. The preview on the right side will allow you to see if the results are relevant based on the keywords you entered. If not, there are several ways we can get rid of irrelevant results. Let's say you don't want other Apple products to get involved in this search. So remove the following words in this field. MacBook, iMac, iPad, iPod. Also, you don't want to get results with the fruit Apple mentioned. So let's remove the following words as well. Diet, healthy, organic, smoothie, and fruit. I use the asterisk at the end of the word fruit to exclude all the words that contain the word fruit. For example, it will automatically remove fruity and fruits. If you don't want to exclude results based on keywords alone, you have several other options. In the upper right corner of each mention, you will find an exclude button. By clicking on this, you will see three options. To exclude all results from this author, to exclude only this one mention, or to exclude the entire domain. In this case, we would remove all Twitter data from this research. Then you will see that there is a separate field to track Instagram hashtags. Due to Instagram data policies, you can only monitor up to 30 hashtags. And that is only if you've authorized your Instagram account on the Centuan platform. Please note, that integration is obligatory in order to see the results. In order to track more hashtags, you can authorize another Instagram business account to double the number of available hashtags. If you feel you are ready to set up, click Continue. Let's name our project. I will call this project iPhone. Then you have a choice of creating an analysis and setting up daily summary alerts via email. 
I would recommend to always enable the analysis option and enable alerts option only if this project is crucial for your day to day work. For example, if you want to receive information where your brand was mentioned online in the last 24 hours on a daily basis, you can do this via email. Click the Save Project button to create the project. There we go. We made our first project. Now the system navigates us to the Mentions view, where we can look at the results of our search.